Hi guys, welcome back to Babylon, where we give you film and music related content. My name is Asaf. I love movies, music, cycling, and chanting in Latin under the full moon. And it's obviously working for you. My name is Itai. I hate Asaf, but I seem to like the band Ghost. Yeah. What are we doing today, sir? Oh, yeah, we're, we're going to react to a song called Cerise by Ghost. This was uh, actually a request by many people. Um, we, we've actually been hit with a lot of ghost requests. Um, ghost removed. Yes. Do yeah, this one. We ghosts, they come to us and they request songs. <laughs> and the first one we're going to do today, which was requested by a ghost, and it's um, Wake Me Up Before You Go-Go by Wham. <laughs> <laughs> no it's a ghost from the 80s so cerise by ghost another uh ghost song that i really know nothing about um we have been making an effort not to um acquaint ourselves with uh you know ghost songs we haven't heard as yet so genuine reaction can do yeah first time reaction so this one is a first time reaction so let's see how we go with this let's go Nightmare on Elm Street much? That's the segment in their talent show. A rock band. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. All right. Zomb Pope. Um, holy shit, this is good. Yep. Um, again, they have this this amazing talent um, to, to to write these sort of really really catchy um, tunes. Um, yeah. The 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 hooks, you know. Can you hear the thunder? Can you hear the rumble? You know, it's just, yeah. I don't know why. It's like, how'd they even think of it? I'm and, not sure. And they fly low. It's in the guise of, of just uh, just another song, but it doesn't. It's not. It's not just another song. 
and, and, grabs and you. here it's the it's the kids version of, of ghost and yeah just something so hypnotic like that bit when he was singing to the girl yeah i was like i'm transfixed <laughs> yeah i'm, like, I'm getting good carry vibes <laughs> yeah just looking at him oh no i got, gonna... I got carry vibes <laughs> yeah from the time she yeah. came in but yeah. he's gonna eat them um, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> scary and the exploitation styling is uh is rather the number it, it makes me we're filmmakers so every time i see something like that that grabs me it makes me it makes me think why 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 haven't i tried to make an exploitation film it looks so cool <laughs> the, the thing is about this one it's like um uh, uh from from that uh uh title at the at the beginning you know cerise mm-hmm. when it went up it's like uh um 80s horror films yeah exorcist Stuff like uh yeah. exorcist yeah, yeah mm-hmm. the omen um that kind of thing a very very uh similar look um everything about it you know has that sort of vibe to it i just don't know where the story is going with this one but yeah <laughs> let's find out <laughs> yeah Yeah. pause I saw something somewhere um, in an interview or something but they were talking about how ghosts do this in uh, in concerts every time they do this song in this bit he, um, the the lead singer goes and, and reaches into the audience and um, does this with random the, kid. You know, with a random a woman kid in the audience a what woman kid? Oh. sorry yeah concerts they don't sorry. have little sorry. kids in the concerts <laughs> what are you talking about and i'm in jail oh, yeah and you're high you have been smoking crack today <laughs> what <Yeah>. random kid <laughs> you come up and say what the fuck are you doing here anyway <laughs> yeah i'm just supposed to be sleeping <laughs> this is an over 18s event <laughs> A random, random. So a random concert goer? That's what I would <laughs> say. <clears throat> yes, yes, a random concert goer. <laughs> a random, usually I, I would assume a woman in the audience that he sings yeah. to and and shakes a hand. So kind of yeah. thing. Which is pretty cool. But yeah, no, I just saw that and it reminded me of that bit that I saw somewhere. But yeah. Yeah. Let's keep it going. Let's see what this horrifying, sick uh, spectacle is going to go. Is going to take us. <laughs> so far, so good. It's getting better and better. We nailed it. I 
Oh, so that's all you had to do? <laughs> There's always someone. <laughs> I don't think they're gonna win that one. When the door started shutting, I can't imagine in the crowd there's there sits Cece Spacek and she goes, ah, "Hey!" <laughs> <laughs> I actually actually thought we were gonna see some exploding heads, but it didn't happen. I think they kept it the PG thirteen, but we nailed it. We said carry vibes, and they have a carry <laughs> a carry uh, homage there. Um, the the thing about this one, this is the first uh, ghost song that we've done that I would actually classify as a ballad yeah i think artistically it's better than the two that we've seen that we've oh it's uh, awesome yeah um, and, and it goes from sort of like a like kind of like a rock ballad to to like it actually slows down yeah you know and and it becomes like a like this almost like a love song uh you know when he sings to like to yeah. her um yeah just freaking awesome um yeah yeah, yeah. If, you, if if you're looking at it at a, at a, as a, from a storyline point of view, from a plot point of view, it's like there's something up with the. Don't look at him as, as a band. There's some sort of morbid connection between him and the girl, and the girl already came. The girl already is who she, what she is in the story because you see it in the first scene. Something's off with this girl, and like he discovers her. Yeah, there's a darkness in yeah. her already, and she came, yeah. and this brings whatever out of her um, yeah. in a way. Um, but but yeah, I don't know. I'm 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 thinking like like I know about the the, the spectacle and the show that they put on every time and all the rest of it. But something about the music, it's just so um, gets under your skin. It's sharp. I think it's just sharp. It's like they've worked out this formula and they're nailing it every time. Yep. You know, and the songs are not, it's not like you can say, oh, they're all the same or something like that. Nope. They're very different. This one, I would and, recognize it's a, it's a ghost song just because of the uh, lead singer's voice. I might have not recognized yeah. this is a ghost song had I not known. But it, it, it has an interesting rhythm to it, you know. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. And I just, yeah, just really liked it. Um, yeah, this, this might be my favorite song. Yeah. I don't know if it's my favorite clip or not, although I did really like it. I, I just like everything they do. They seem to put an interesting spin on on whatever it is they they put before us. Um, but yeah, another 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 song that just kicks ass. Yeah, um, they had me at exploitation and and carry homage, and the rest is just just wow. To tell you the truth, they had me with the first time they hit that hook in the song. I was like, hang on a second, what what is this? Um, yeah, yeah, I don't know. I I can't wait to actually, uh, you know, start playing their CDs on rotation. Um, <clears throat> okay, <laughs> CDs. <laughs> People don't know what that is, so just put them on on, on my playlist. Let's say I'm um, gonna use my manual gramophone after this. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that's how I start my car every morning. Um. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Just I'm I'm very, very like I knew of Ghost before we started doing this, and I've never actually heard their stuff. And since we started doing this, this is about I don't know how many songs we've done so far, three, four, five. Um, and it's yeah, it's just awesome every time. Yeah, yeah. It's a good I'm song, it's a good band. It. Yeah. I yeah. think so I, I feel like we, I've discovered we... sorry, yeah. Yeah. I, mean, if, okay. I feel like to me personally, I feel like I've discovered a band that I'm going to listen to for years to come. To listen to this band when I'm 80, if I make it that far. The, the, the thing is, we, we, we all already have uh, however many requests, you know, for, for ghost songs, and um, that makes me happy. Yeah, keep them coming. Keep them coming. Hit us up in the comments, Absolutely. give us requests to ghost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. After, <laughs> after we do that, we'll start doing their albums. Yeah, um, but yeah, no, the they're, they're definitely yeah. They're, they're a lot of fun. I, I always thought that. Ghost were a much heavier sort of metal band, and I'm finding out that they're not at all what I thought they were. Yeah. So, 
I'm it, loving this. They it feels like they, they can hide behind mainstream tone. And you if, if you if you give it if you give it a little bit more deeper thought, you realize that they're not. They're the real they're the real thing. I don't know if it's like a mainstream thing or it's just like a pop sensibility inside yeah. the rock metal or whatever you want to call it. That yeah. pop thing is definitely there, you know. Yeah. But it's it's um, it's a mask. It feels like a mask because they, they have a lot I more think, than... I, don't, I don't think it is. I think it's just part of the formula. Um I think that they've they've cracked this formula that you know how to um you know, write songs that have this sort of rock edge to it that that um, bring forth the, I don't know, let's call it message, even if it's a fake message that they're trying to put across that is to do with, you know, the dark, the, the, the dark arts, let's call it. Um, and um, at the same time, it's just catchy as hell because of that pop part, you know, of it. Um, similarly, you know, you've mentioned before um, Electric Cowboy, where they also mix like you know this sort of hardcore stuff with pop, um, and it just works. Which means that really, pop is just makes everything better. Yeah, we need to do more pop. We need yeah. to do more just straight pop. <laughs> yeah, we should try Michael Jackson in the future. Yeah, and and I, I always said you know people ask me you know they're like do you listen to pop and I say well I listen to anything that's good. Um, so within pop, there's a lot of good stuff. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm actually a big like Duran Duran fan. I just love their stuff. Um, I used to love Michael Jackson, even, you know, he's the king of pop, but his music wasn't exactly pop. There was a lot of R&B and stuff in there. But um, but yeah, yeah, again, uh, uh, back to Ghost. More to come, more to come. Definitely. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, yeah, <clears throat> yeah, loving it. So if you enjoyed this video, guys, please be sure to like, subscribe, and click the little bell icon so you'll get notified on all our future videos. Please share our stuff. It will help us grow our channel and encourage us to make a lot more videos for you guys. Hit us up in the comments. Let us know what you think about Cerise by Ghost. Did you like it? Did you hate it? How can you hate it? Come on. And hit and you know, uh, put your requests in, and we will do our best to comply. <clears throat> Yes, our uh, uh, link to our uh, Buy Me A Coffee is down in the description. If you want your request to be bumped up, we'll try to get them done as quickly as possible. Um, otherwise, they just get in a queue, which is getting longer and longer. Um, also, if you just want to contribute you know, to the show, help us uh, 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 you know, improve in various areas, whether it is equipment or anything else, um, feel free to contribute. Um, we would much appreciate it. And um, yeah, and again, thank you for being here. Thank you for your time. Thank you for sticking with us. Um, we are loving this journey and we hope that you do as much as we do. So yeah, see you again real soon, guys. Real soon. Bye, guys.